Pam, get up. Oh, did you really have to pack in my room? I wanted to leave you something to remember me by. Well, get ready before the plane leaves you behind. Your athletic scholarship awaits and my life. Wow. I told you I canceled the flight like last week. I'm gonna ride with Alex. Wait, you, you did what? Why would you do that? Wait, who the hell is Alex? Alexandria Matthews, mom. Lovely From little uh, slice of life uh, short film. Um, just so sweet. Uh, such, a, such a nice rapport that we had between the actresses playing the mother and the daughter. Um, I could have watched those two play off of each other all day. Um, uh, very, very sensitive and uh, nice writing to this story. Um, I thought it was well told. It, uh, it's a, like in a short story like this, it's nice when uh, the, the elements of the story go beyond what we're watching, this little story that we're telling. And this thing was just really rich with outside um, references and uh, little uh, tangents that we could imagine going off here and there. So it really gave the characters a full, rich life. And these uh, the actresses playing these characters really embodied these women so well also that it also gave us a sense that there was so much more to this story than the little bit that we're watching. But the bit that we were watching was just so sweet, so uh, so well done. Um, it really um, gave the, um, the, the really translated what this part of a person's life, both for the mother and for the daughter, can mean to them. So, um, well done. Uh, very enjoyable. I loved this film. <laughs> I love these two women. I love their relationship. The writing was so great. Um, it was it was so real. I, I felt like I really was standing in a room. It was like not just beautifully acted, but beautifully written to the point where it was just it felt real. It felt natural. It didn't pull me out for one second. Um, the moment she found that letter and then she found all the art supplies and she started crying. I was just beside myself. Um, it's a beautiful, beautiful testament to the love of a mother and a daughter. And I just really loved everything about it. I love the location. I love the direction. Like I said, the writing is amazing. The lighting is beautiful. Like when she's painting at the end of the movie and there's just the way that the light is hitting her face and the way that the light is hitting the paint. It's just so special. It's such a beautiful, beautiful film. Um, the neighbor with the dog, hilarious, so funny. Um, just really, really smart, really great writing and direction and acting and shooting. It's just all good. I really Congrats. enjoyed this film, it had a lot of heart. It was just really moving and, and really funny too. It was really, really funny opening like dream sequence and such a great transition to um real life and the real story and yeah i just really enjoyed that mother daughter you know relationship dynamic for going off to college i just really enjoyed it and i thought it was great so yeah it's such a lovely story and it was so well acted i believed that they were mother and daughter and the closeness of their relationship. There were times where I laughed out loud. It was it was funny and then it went immediately in the other direction where it was very, very tender. And you really felt that that heartbreak of a mom having to say goodbye to her daughter who was going away to college and still wanting to protect her. So it was it was a lovely story about family and about letting go and about finding yourself. Um, Shots wise, I think that the director of photography, the cinematographer did such a great job. One of my favorite moments was what they did with the phone. And I thought that that was so clever to add that insert and to have it be someone who you, you know, where you can actually see it, where they didn't have to do a cutaway. It was in the actual frame. So that was really well done. Everything on this hit home. 
it it really made you feel like you were looking into um, a little slice of life of what was happening. And you felt the emotion of that too. And then you felt the happiness too when she started to paint at the end, finding that again. It was very this cool. This is a very cute, relatable recount of the emptying nest process and the feelings attached to that, both from the parents' perspective and from the kids' perspective. The kids that are leaving the nest to pursue their own rooms and the parents that are left to regain or reestablish what they liked before having kids. And yep, this top, this title is just super, super clever and I really enjoyed the performance. The nest was a really sweet story about a, a single mother and sending her daughter off to college. Um, you know, leaving the nest, becoming an empty nester. And you kind of see a little glimpse of what her future may be like after her daughter is out of the house uh, with that little hookup scene. But overall, it was, um, you know, a real touching look at a mother and her care for her daughter, the person that she's been with, you know, their entire life. And now they're going off to college and they're just leaving the nest and the concern and the worry that you have, even when they're still home. Um and just the responsibility and the, the burden that this woman, like, holds, um, you know, not only being a single mother, but, you know, even on her day off, she's getting calls from the office, and a lot of people rely on her, and she just needs this moment to kind of, like, you know, accept the fact that her daughter is going. Um, just a real touching uh, tribute to the mother-daughter relationship, and, you know watching your child leave the home. It was just a very sweet uh, short to watch. I loved how mature uh, the relationship was between the mother and daughter. It didn't feel like every other story about a young girl going to college for the first time and leaving her mom. There were moments that sort of hinted towards a more stereotypical relationship, like the overbearing mom and the rebellious daughter. But their performances and the script was so much more nuanced than that. Um, the idea that the mother is finally going to be able to pursue her artistic uh, passions, um, the way that they developed her as having, um, you know, a sex life and being a, an adult woman was really, really nice because uh, it's not often you get to see a mother character who feels like a fully fleshed human being um, outside of her relationship with her child. I also really loved the daughter. I loved her relationship with her friend. I loved how much she loves her mom and how she notices that her mother is missing these elements in her life. So overall, I thought it was such a touching story and I loved that both the mother and daughter taught each other something in a really healthy way.